Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. I just wanted to do a quick um, Dollar Tree haul. I went to Dollar Tree real quick today and I got these little drawers because I want to take care of this mess right here. That is just my attempt at organizing things, my embellishments for my memory cards, for my memory dex cards. I'm trying to categorize them so that it's kind of like a kitchen and a chef would have all of his ingredients separated out into little bowls and stuff. I, and I see people doing that with the little bowls, but I want something where I can say, okay, I just made these flowers. Okay, flowers go in here. Rosettes go in here. Okay, that one's full. We don't need any more rosettes. Let's use those all up. Okay, I've stamped a bunch of images and cut them out on my um, brother scan and cut. They go there. That's full. Okay, let's use that up. See what I mean? Um, that kind of thing. Or I have a bunch of, you know, circles. Okay, and scallop circles and things like that. Those go in another um, little bin. I have a bunch of little words little little words like this okay well they go in a different one so I think I'm gonna get maybe six more hot glue them together and then that way they'll always be a unit and I can move them around the room as needed okay because that's I don't know if you're this way but my scrap room is always changing and the rest of this is, is a disaster, but it's kind of working for me. This is also from the Dollar Tree. I didn't get this today, but this is how I kind of keep things standing up. And I use these racks in a lot of different ways. I'll do a room tour soon where I will show you how I use these racks from the Dollar Tree in different, different ways. Okay, so, so like I stick my my paper trimmer in there fits perfectly in there so that way everything is like lined up but my whole goal in having this shelf was so that I could still have the table under there so this is defeating my purpose I want the table more open okay um, okay what else did I get this was something I got from the Goodwill like a couple weeks ago cute right so I got these dowels and the craft boxes to make memory dex boxes. And then these are just stamps that I took off of there. And then I got these little treasure boxes for the grandkids to make a project when we have them over in a couple of weeks. If it's raining, we can do that. If we can't go fishing or do the slip and slide, then we can do that. And then that's for my 15 year old for high school, for his Spanish class. I found this, uh, really cute, isn't it? For rosettes, so these are gonna be big rosettes. So I'll make a video showing you how these turn out. And then I got some pens because I saw several YouTubers showing these pens and they do write very nicely these are all black ink but i tend to need black ink pens and they write nicely they're smooth just like it says and then just your classic sharpie right to write addresses on happy mail so it doesn't seem like i used this one today but i really wished i had a black thin one and what else did I get from the Dollar Tree? I think that's it. I didn't get anything else, so I think I did pretty well. And this mess, um, yeah, it's gonna be taken care of. You wanna see a, you wanna a quick glance? This is, this is my kingdom. I'm sitting in the middle of the room right now. And those are my lights for my teaching. 
because I have to have really good lighting for teaching online. And there's my teaching corner. Okay, so everything in that corner has to do with teaching. And then my pegboard and the two machines I use the most, my Cricut and my Brother Scan and Cut and my typewriter. And then this holds like my inks and things like that. And couple of my rest cogs but I'll do more of a depth in depth one and then here's the table in the middle that's where I generally sit my husband sits over there and I sit here and then we watch TV and we talk and joke around and stuff and yeah and that's my window and my view to my beautiful yard so thanks again for watching everybody bye